Okay, I just realized something. And I'm not gonna make a community post about it. I would, but not a lot of people. Some people are on certain devices where they cannot see community posts. So I'm making this for everyone to see. I think I know why Brian's parents are dead. And so, if you remember, Jakey, everyone has to have a motive. Just like Brian, the, the motive behind Brian joining the Protector's Guild was because of his parents' death and he wanted to protect anyone that was in his situation or who, have, who were going through the same trauma that he did. So, Jakey, future Jakey, Jakey from an alternate timeline, like actual R. Jakey said, Jakey said that that other Jakey, this is getting confusing, that other Jakey was from a different timeline. So that Jakey must have a motive. And why would he go after Brian? This is where I think something happened in an alternate timeline. Where Brian did something to Jakey. Perhaps kill Oliver? Maybe kill somebody that he loved like Oliver because if you think about it when we met future Jakey he didn't have his Oliver so he Brian might have either lost control or Brian was actually a really evil person or it was an accident he killed Oliver so Jakey got mad and wanted revenge so he went to an alternate timeline and killed Brian's, they are Brian's parents. So then, I bet, like, he's thinking, like, if I have to suffer, then I'll let you suffer, but it was a different Brian. And then, our Brian blamed his, his Jakey, when it wasn't actually his Jakey, it was, a di it was a different Jakey. And that actually explains a lot. We have motive. It is, it is, it could be canonically true for continuity's sake because the in um meeting like evil Jakey and evil K episode, I forgot what number it was. It Jakey did not have Oliver, so I think you have your answer. Goodbye.